All right, in this video, I'm going to go over blog categories and how to add them to your uh, navigation up on the top. I have the Tesseract 3.2.8. You may have a little bit newer version than this, but either way, it will work. So the first thing you want to do is make sure you have some categories and posts associated to it. So I got all these posts and I have made some categories here within the post. So I'm going to click on this categories and I made some categories. You have the child categories and you also have these parent categories. So you could have like subcategories, which are child categories if you want to do that. But I'm just going to go over like categories and you could associate your posts to your categories. So in order to do that, you would first go to the all posts and um, in when you're editing the post, for example, this post right here, you'll notice that I associated it to some categories and child posts as well. So I associated this one, this one, and these two as well. So that's what I did right there. And it helps to understand these categories so that you could add these to your bar. So in order to make a category, of course, you just go to the categories again here. And I'm sorry if I'm being redundant, but I just want to be clear to everybody. And you want to be able to just add your name, your slug, and if it's a parent to whoever. So if it's like a subcategory of this category, then you make it a parent category of that. And this one was a sub subcategory, you know, and it goes over just like that. So you could add categories and subcategories right there. Now, uh, now you want to go into, if you want to put it up on the top navigation, customize. So let's go to customize right here. And you want to go into your menus right up here. So I'm going to click on menus and I'm going to click on the top menu. So I just made a menu right here. And let's say I want to add items to this. So um, I already, let's say I want to add like a category, I, uh, categorical items and stuff. So you go to categories right here and I can add these categories to uh, my to my thing. So this is a parent category. This is a parent category. So I'm just going to click on that and then it's going to add itself to that category. I could also add a subcategory to that. Um, so let's say I add a child category to that parent child category and it will add it right here. But what you want to do if it's a subcategory is kind of move it to the right so it has a drop down. I'm going to show you how that looks when I press save right now. And let's go and refresh the home page or any other page. We'll go to this page. You got this parent category and then sub child category right now. So if you go to the parent category, you'll see all the blogs for that parent category. And then you go to child category and it will show just that specific category. So let's say you had a category called toys but then you had some specific toys as a child category, then you could uh, drill into those categories right there. I hope this helps out narrow down the categories and helps you guys put this on your, um, your header so that you could really uh, drill down your parent categories and subcategories. I know how important it is to everyone that we have a WordPress blog and we make these specific categories and subcategories and stuff. Let me know if you have any questions and just, you know, play with it and stuff. And I'm sure you'll, you'll, you'll get this after you watch this video, maybe a couple times. All right. Thanks a lot.